Okay, I think we're, we're livey livey. Livey livey. Livey livey. Livey livey. Alright, we're live. What do we need? Oh yeah, that was not a good session last time. Let's go dump some stuff off. Dumping it off. Hey guys, I got 32 second slow mode on so I can read your questions actually. Hello, 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 hello. Do I have, I got coal. I got coal, I got coal. Um, let's get rid of some jum, junk. Get rid of some junk here. Cool. Hey everyone, what's going on? Welcome, welcome to another edition of the Daily Dose. Welcome to the dosiest daily, the dailiest dose of the gaming, the ghost gumbing bunga bunga. I'm in a good mood today, and uh, good to have you guys here. Welcome. I'm. We're just gonna sit here and watch some gold be made. Oh, uh, can you tame a dog and name it a banana? Interesting questions you guys have today. Um, interesting questions. As usual, we're gonna put a little bit here. Yeah, so I don't know. I'm in a good mood. I'm in a great mood. Wow, let's get hyped! Woo! You guys, you guys want to hear me scream? Have you ever heard Daily Dose scream? Uh, press one if you want to see if you want to hear Daily Dose scream. Press one if you want to hear Daily Dose scream. Are you guys ready? Let, before I scream, let's 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 wait for a few more people to get here. Let's wait for a few more people to get here, and then I'll just scream. I'll scream my head off. I I feel like screaming, so we're gonna scream for a little bit. Cause why not? I bet none of you've ever heard Daily Dose scream before. So um. Wait, was there stuff in there? Oh, that's right. Wait, where, where is it? Why does it keep disappearing? Oh, it's right here. All right, well, we'll wait for a few more people to get here, and then you're, you guys are gonna hear Daily Dose scream. Um, because it does hurt my voice. That's why I don't like to scream. I don't like to raise my voice or any of that stuff, because it hurts. Some people love screaming. I don't get it. All right. Oh, 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 should we scream now? Is it time? Is it time to scream? What should I scream? What should I say? What should I say when I scream? Should I say something like, um, what should I say? All ready? All right, we're, we're gonna scream. Uh, I gotta think of something to say though. I gotta think of something to say before I scream. Um, All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay back a little bit from the from the mic. Should or should I do my intro? I should do my, I should do my intro. I should do my intro. Okay. Hello, everyone. This is your daily dose of internet. How was that? Was that good? Was that pretty good? Oh my gosh. Oh, well, oh, I guess you guys just heard Daily Dose scream. So, um, should we try it again? I feel like, I feel like that scream was too, too high pitched. Let's, let's try a little, a uh, lower pitch. Let's try a lower pitch, um, scream here. <clears throat> I gotta, I gotta get mad. I gotta get mad. So I gotta get in character. Hello everyone, this is your daily dose of internet! How was that? Was that beautiful? Alright, well, there you go. So now we are back to being peaceful and nice 
And we got the scream out of the way so we can get back to focusing on things that we love. Which is not screaming. So now my, my voice is, hurts a little bit right there. But, um, yeah. Nice little uh, attention-grabbing situation there. But none of you ever heard Daily Dose scream before, but now you have. Uh, we're going to put some of this gold away. Oh, man. Yeah, so how was that? You, you guys, your mind is blown right now because you never heard Daily Dose scream before? Never heard Daily Dose scream before? Well, now you have. Um, we need... How are the mutton chops doing? Oh, we already got those? Oh, we need to cook some chicken. Some little chick, 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 chickens. I think one little coal should do the trick, right? Um, yeah. So I can't wait for people to clip that. That'll be that'll be fun to see that on Twitter or something. Um, but yeah, some people just yell all the time. Like how? How do you yell all the time? And your like my my voice hurts after screaming one time, one time. And some people just scream constantly. It's just like, how do you do that? How do you have the uh, voice ability, the voice capacity to just scream constantly? It's just I don't know. I I can't deal with that. Um. We're going to keep this beetroot. Yeah. Uh, oh, that's what I want to do. I want to make a... I want to make a... Oh, we want to go to this thingy. I got to make a couple. Eh, probably just need one, actually. Yeah, I just need one. Um, yeah, I don't know. Some people can just scream all the time. For those of you who showed up late, I'm very sorry you missed out on the screaming. You missed Daily Dose Screaming, but you might watch it. You might see it later uh, on Twitter or something. Um, what are we cooking here again? Ah, uh, we got a lot of iron. So we're good here. We don't need any more. We're going to put that away. Yeah, so uh, I'm just here to uh, talk to you guys, see what your questions are. You guys got any good questions for me? Um, I would like to see like some actual... Well thought out questions if you have them. Um, like, hey Jason, what was your what is your greatest accomplishment? And then I would say, daily dose of internet. That's what I would say. Um, do I know Carl Jacob? Yep, I know him. I'm gonna watch Food Wars. What is that? What's your nationality? Already answered that. Polish. I am Polish. Um, <laughs> I went back into the stream to, just to see you so yelling again. You know, you can't ask me a question that I just asked myself. You can't do that. Um, okay, we are going to... Oh, we want to make... Yeah, we're going to make another pickaxe. That's my goal. And then we'll go digging again, I think. Yeah. Um, yeah, I don't know. I was going to say, some people are, are very afraid of yelling because they're very shy. And there was a time in my life where I, I don't know, maybe it was like high school or something. And I thought to myself, oh my gosh, I've never screamed before. I've never screamed. I've never been so, I've never been aggressive like that before. What would happen if I screamed? And I, I was so embarrassed that one time I, I think I went, I just found like an, a, a big field where there was no one around, and I screamed, and it was such a weird feeling. I was like, oh my gosh, this is so weird. This is so weird. Like, I, I felt violent for the first time in my life. And, uh, yeah, and that was a weird thing. No, I'm much more comfortable screaming, because I'm much more comfortable with who I am and what I do. Um, okay. I'm going to make one iron pickaxe, just because. And then we should be good to go. But yeah, I'm sure a lot of you have have dealt with that too. Who very um, might be insecure, might be afraid of aggression, might be afraid of showing aggression. Some of, some people are really easy at 
at doing that. I have a have an easy time of doing that, but um, it's not nighttime yet, so I can't sleep. All right, well, we're gonna go find a place to go digging, and we're just gonna go dig right. Up. We haven't we've never dug over here, so let's just go over here. Oh, you know what? I don't. All right, I got I got torches. Um. Yeah, but I gosh, I think like so many people are just we're just afraid of what they sound like. And you know, when when you're when you're in high school, when you're young, a lot of young people are very insecure about what they sound like. Um and I was one of them. I was very insecure about what I sounded like. So um yeah, so screaming into the middle of a field was a very weird time. In my life. Where's your armor? Relax. Oh, oh. Yeah, you must be um, a new person. Okay, so a few episodes ago, we fell into lava, lost everything. I had about like 40 diamonds, and I lost them all. So I'm down to basically two diamonds, and I have them on me, so I should probably put these back in before we go forward and then um, we'll continue but yeah it's um, unfortunately was not not a good time so now we got to go let me go to sleep and then we'll, we'll do this um, so now we gotta go find some more diamonds because I went to the nether I went to go fight and or at least figure things out and then I died so and lost everything I have diamonds. Yeah, I know I got diamonds. I got two of them. Yeah, I, I will. Yeah. Um, so let's go drop these off. Drop these off over here. And then we'll go digging. Um, there they are. What's in here? Nothing. Sweet. So let's go find some diamonds. It's not going to be a lot of fun. I already know that, so that's why I'm going to hang out with you guys, ask you some questions, and you ask me some questions, and we'll have a fun time. And let me switch this out and put food in there instead. Food should always be in slot number one. Um, someone says, am I... What happened? I guess someone stalked me and tried to kill me, but... um. They weren't very good at it. Now were they? Um, okay. Someone says, am I okay? Yeah, I'm okay. I'm just in a goofy mood right now. Um, I'm actually in a really great mood because uh, my new video did very well. A lot of you really loved it. Um, and it's always it always feels good when a video does well because when you work hard on something, you want to see it do well. And so it did really well. Um... So yeah, we're just going to go to the Diamond World, our favorite place. Bro, please use your armor. Uh, I mean, yeah, eventually I'll get to it. Um, eventually. But we're not going to fight anyone. We're not going to... I know that's not the plan, but I am playing... Uh, I think I'm playing on easy mode, so... Uh, definitely not hardcore or anything like that, so... I should be fine. If I was playing hardcore or stuff like that, I would definitely take this a little more seriously. Um, but we are not in that sort of situation, so we're okay. Um, yeah. Oh, uh, thanks for the $10. Um, do you support cannibalism? No, I do not. Well, I don't know. I guess it just depends on the situation, you know? You can't just... You can't just judge someone like that, you know? What if they were forced to? The, and, and they said, okay, we're going to um, murder a hundred people unless you eat this this random person. And be like, okay, well, I guess I gotta do it. So, you gotta know what the situation is. Um, my voice still hurts from screaming, so I hope it was worth it. I really hope that was worth it, because I hate screaming, it's not fun for me, um, and I, I screamed twice, ouch, uh, um, 
Any any good questions, guys? Oh. Um. So we are almost at where we need to be. How long have I been playing Minecraft? Since uh, I guess 2011. So it's been a while. It's been a while. Um, but we, yeah, we're just here to find some diamonds. So once I get down to the level, I will play cl pay closer attention to your questions that you're asking. Um, very close. Once I get down there, we will take a peek and get going with you guys. I think it's 11, right? It's 11, so we'll go more. One more. Beautiful. All right, so we're going to hang out on this level, and then we'll talk to you guys. <laughs> That's... <laughs> I can't believe I screamed. What a goofball. I'm such a goofball. You are the most calming person. Love your videos. Thank you. Thank you so much. Why were you screaming? Oh, you missed it. Oh, well, when this video is over, you'll... Um, if I keep it up. I don't know if I'll keep it up. We'll see. But I'm sure someone, someone clipped that or something. You'll see it, don't worry. Do you remember me from Twitter? Yes, of course, random person. I don't know who you are. Um. Oh, that's right. Hello, everyone. This is your Diodosa Gaming. So, welcome, everyone. Welcome to the stream. We're just hanging out, talking about Minecraft, talking about everything, everything... Anything interesting? Alright, well, if you guys aren't going to ask me anything interesting, what do you guys think about my tweet today? The fact that orcas have very strict diets. They, some of them will, well, technically it's cultural, so it's learned cultural behavior, so uh, orcas will only eat certain animals uh, based on what their pot is eating. Um, so if you're an orca that grew up only eating seals, you will only eat seals. If you're an orca that grew up that only ate fish, you will only eat fish. I, they had this, um, they documented these orcas and they, they captured them somehow. I don't know if it was in an enclosure or in the ocean. Point is they captured them and they tried feeding them fish and they refused to eat anything for 70 days. Um... Until eventually they figured out, I think, what they ate, and they gave it to them, and they're they're happy. But they refused to eat the fish that they were offering. Like, yeah, we don't want it. We'd rather starve than eat whatever it is that you're offering. So, or and that's why orcas don't eat humans. We have no documentation of them ever eating a human in the wild. I don't I don't know about in, um, in captivity because in, in captivity obviously they're all very sad they don't want to be there they're basically in prison so um i wouldn't blame them if they try to eat someone just to try and make a point that they don't they don't want to be there um but yeah that's they they have no desire to eat humans they have a very strict diet they don't want to eat these things oh i think i just heard a witch that is here a witch okay um, what was your first car? My first car was a, it was a Honda CRV, and, um, yeah, I don't know, it was a, it was a, it was a 2000, so it was built in 2000, I think, it was an old, old Honda CRV, and it was fun, it was a fun car, bad gas mileage, horrible gas mileage, but, uh, I don't know what to say, it was, it was, a uh, just... A good car. Reliable, didn't break or anything. So, yeah. Why are you lonely today? Ah, I, I don't know. Because um, my group of friends that I usually play games with are are not available. So, um, I guess you guys are going to be my group of friends today. How does that sound? Is that okay? Can you be my friend, please? Okay, so we are at a place, and I don't want to be here, so we're going to close this up. We'll go check it over here. Um, what are your thoughts on the... L Come on, guys. Let's get some good questions here. Uh, 
what is your favorite book? Um, I think I said this before about how to make friends and influence people. That book changed my life. Like, actually changed my life. So, um, yeah, I highly recommend that video. We're just going to block you off. Yeah, how to make friends and influence people. I think it's an old book from like the 1950s, something like that. And, um, yeah, so I don't know. It's, a, it's an amazing, amazing book. Taught me how to be a better person, taught me how to talk to people, taught me how. Um, taught me so many amazing things. Like, for example, um, if you want to change, if you want to change someone's opinion, um, you never want to tell them that they're wrong. Never tell someone that they're wrong. And the reason why is because um, it'll immediately shut them down. And as soon as you tell them that they're wrong, so imagine like something that you believed to be true your entire life, and then someone just comes that you, regardless if you know them or not, just goes, "Yeah, you're wrong." You think you're gonna be open-minded about that? No, of course not. So let's say, um, I believe that tomatoes um, will give me superpowers. I believe that. Um, Tomatoes make me jump higher. Okay, I just I just believe that when I eat them, I jump higher. And then someone comes along and says, "So I'll be the the person that comes along and that changes their mind in a polite sense." So I'll be like, "Hey, so I think you bring up some pretty good arguments about why tomatoes can make you jump higher. I think it's interesting. I, I've never heard of those that uh, viewpoint before. Um, however, I I think I've here's some other things that I've learned as well about Maybe tomatoes uh, can have other benefits, not necessarily for jumping higher, but more for this. And, oh, I, I learned something that maybe tomatoes don't actually help you jump higher. What do you think about that? Because, I mean, I'm, I'm just trying to be, I'm not trying to, I'm not trying to tell you what to think or feel, but um, based on what I've read, I haven't really found anything that makes you jump higher based off eating tomatoes. Can you find me where you found that? I just, I don't really, I, I don't see the correlation there. So when you're, when you're, when you're doing that, you're opening their mind and they're less likely to shut down. They're less likely to be open. Like, oh, it, it makes them think. And if you can make someone think and second guess what they're thinking about, then you're more likely to have success in changing their viewpoint. So... Uh, do I like soccer? Um, I like, uh, so I like, uh, World Cup stuff. I love the World Cup. All right, you guys want to hear my complaint about, uh, football, soccer? Here's the problem about, um, you know, Premier League, Champions League, that sort of stuff. There's no parody. No parody at all. Yes, you get to watch some of the greatest athletes go at it, and it's, it's beautiful to watch. However, if you're a fan of, like, a very small team, it's it's like it's basically like why even bother watching? It's your team has no chance. There's no parity. There's absolutely no parity whatsoever. The same six teams are so always win the championship. And it's like well, what's what's the fun in that? What's the point of even supporting a small team if I already know like uh, the the odds are against me that I'm not going to uh, I'm not going to win. So that's why some uh, that's the one thing that I've noticed about uh, football just doesn't do very well. Um, but that's why I like the World Cup, because there's a lot. There's so much parity. Like, really, any team could win um, for the most part. Uh, obviously, you know, there will always be your big countries, but, you know, it's, um, it's, it's a lot more up in the air. It's a lot, a lot more parity. Um, how many subscribers did I ever get to ex expect to get from Daily Dose of Internet? I just kind of did it for fun, and then it just took off, and then that's where it is. So I never expected really anything from it. Um, yeah, did you guys enjoy the new video today? Oh, and then for people that didn't hear already, hello everyone, this is your Daily Dose of Gaming. So, maybe... Um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed the 
the video today. I thought it was a really good one. The cat getting, being born from a couch. As soon as I, as soon as I saw that video, I was like, oh my gosh, that's going to be an amazing thumbnail. So guess what? I was right. It was an amazing, amazing thumbnail. So funny. So interesting. Um, yeah. It's my 15th birthday. Happy birthday, dude. What's your favorite song uh, right now? I don't know. Um, what I've been digging lately is 1980s songs, like that genre. Just because I feel like, well, because that's not when I was born. So I don't know that genre very well. So I'm kind of diving into that. And I'm, I'm finding a lot of good songs from the 80s. It was, a lot of them kind of sound the same. But... Um, yeah, and I was like, there's some killer ones, like um, The Man Who Sold the World. Um, like, that's such a good song, and uh, it's just beautiful. But yeah, lots of good songs from the 80s. But yeah, I'm, I'm really not going to accomplish very much of anything in this, in in terms of Minecraft, but I'm, I'm just kind of here to hang out with you guys, talk to you guys, ask uh, answer some questions you might have for me. Do you listen to ASMR? No. No. Where did I? Oh, we got diamonds. Woo! <laughs> yes, diamonds. It's been way too long. Way too long. So we got. How many was that? One. Two. Three. Four. Good job. Well, I'll tell you what. It's it's nice to finally get diamonds because we were struggling for a long, long time. Someone said, where did I work before YouTube? I worked at a bank. Uh, I was miserable, hated my life, depressed, um, and YouTube saved my life. So I'm very thankful, and I'm thankful every day that um, YouTube decided to come into my life and uh, save my life. So I'm very I'm very thankful for that aspect. Um, yeah. So, yeah, I mean, you guys, uh, the fact that you guys watch me, the fact that you guys watch my videos, literally, um, saved my life, made me, give me, uh, uh, literally gave me a reason to live and purpose in my life, because I had no purpose in my life up until that point. I felt, uh, I felt completely dead inside, so, yeah. I'm just so happy that, um, YouTube happened. YouTube was, is the greatest thing that ever happened in my life. Um, but yeah, I mean, I'm still, I'm still a lonely person. Um, I don't know, but I kind of do that to myself. I don't really make a much of an effort to make friends, but I'm sure a lot of people do that too. I, I don't know. I'm very selective about my friends and stuff. I, I'm not, I'm very, um, I'm not overly trusting. Like I'm, I'm open about a lot of things, but I'm not, um, I don't know. I just... It's hard to see through intentions of people. Like, what are you trying to do? Like, why do you want to be my friend? I don't know. Have you ever... Um, let's see. Do you know... Do you experience imposter syndrome? I forgot what that means. So, I can't answer that. I literally forgot what that means. Um, do I still have iron? Dang. Um... I don't want to use my diamond pickaxes because I'm really not finding any diamonds, so I need to go f switch to iron, I think. So we're just going to use this one up and then we'll switch to iron. Um, why did you make Daily Dose Internet? Uh, because um, there were, I don't know, I, I just felt like the internet deserved better. It's like, I don't know, I just felt like... I could provide better better than what was out there right now. I was like, I, I feel like I can do a better job than um, some of these other people. And so I was like, I, I think the internet deserves better than what's currently out there. So, Imposter syndrome is when you think you should be credited by major accomplishments. I don't feel like that's right. I've heard it in a different aspect before. I don't know. I don't know if that's right. 
you know how I just said like, I don't know, I'm not going to say that, but we love your channel, thank you. Why you make this channel? Because I want to talk to my peeps and game and hang out for a little bit. Why not? Why wouldn't I make this channel? Why would I not do that? Well, since we're here, I could make another iron pickaxe so I don't have to use up my last one because I don't want to use my iron pickaxes. So let's put down our crafting table over here. Um, here, here, here. Put it right there. And then, oh, we got to melt it, smelt it, dealt it first now, don't we? So we got to bring our little oven here. And we'll do that. Sorry, I'll get back to your questions in a second. I just got to make some iron real quick. Because I thought I had some, but I guess I don't. Um, why don't you play Fortnite? Hey, good for you. I just made a video about that. So, why don't you go watch it? Um... Are you religious? Uh, oh, that's a big question. I don't know if I want to answer that. Um, I'm really not in the mood for deep questions right now, to be <laughs> to be honest. Usually I am, but I'm I'm just not, I'm just kind of like I'm feeling good. I'm on a, I'm on a high right now. I'm not high. I'm just saying like I'm on a a feel good high right now. So I'm I'm, I'm in a good mood, and um, I don't know. I don't want to think about deep things right now. Although it's something I, I usually like like to do. Um, what's your? I'm trying to find a good question here. Come on, man! A quick answer. I don't know what you're saying. You guys, some of you, some of you are actually legitimately getting upset and mad at me because I'm not answering your question, and I don't know what to say because um. How do I make, I forgot how to make sticks. How do I make sticks again? Oh, okay, there you go. And it's just like, yeah, some of you need to just relax. It's going to be okay, I promise. It's going to be okay. I can't answer every question, unfortunately, as much, as cool as that would be. I, I, I just can't. Um, so, yeah. What are your what was your school life like? Okay, my school life was um I don't know. Uh lonely, not very not super cool. I just kind of avoided people, did my thing, didn't have very many friends. Um but also I was also very shy. I mean, I, I'm still shy today and uh, I always will be shy in that aspect. But um I'll tell you what, I, I was just afraid of everyone. Basically, I was, I didn't trust anyone. I was just very shy for whatever reason about everyone and everything. Um, I remember one time, maybe, I think, there's probably been three times in high school where a girl tried hitting on me and asking me out, and um, I, I didn't know what to say. I, I didn't know what to say, so I just kind of like, I don't know. I, I was just very, very shy. Um, I remember, yeah, one girl was like, she sent me a note in class. She said, hey, what are you doing this weekend? Did you want to hang out? And then I just straight up lied. I said, um, yeah, I think I'm babysitting someone's child, so I can't hang out. <laughs> and it stinked because I actually had a big crush on her. I had a very big crush on her. And um, I thought she was very beautiful, but I, I, when I, I, I was so inept. I I literally denied my crush, so there's that situation. When you're so inept that you deny your crush, <whistles> that's pretty sad. Pretty sad. Um. Someone called me a Chad for denying my crush. <laughs> you're Chad for denying your crush. Not necessarily. It's just when you're so inept. When you're so inept that you don't know how to talk to girls that you deny your crush when she literally asks you out. 
Yeah. Um, just trying to read some of your questions here. Okay, let's go back to our questions here. Uh, inept means incapable, um, not capable of doing something. You're not good at doing something. You don't know how to handle a situation. That's what inept means. Has your shyness gotten better? Oh yeah, a million times better. Um, I'm much more confident now. I'm so confident now that I can scream in front of uh, a couple thousand people. Well, 1,400 people or whoever many people were here when I when I screamed. So I'm I'm definitely much more confident, and I would not definitely not do that now. If someone asked me out like that, I would not deny them out of ineptitude. Um, but yeah. Oh yeah, just a disclaimer: we're not doing anything this round. We're just mining for diamonds. That's it. So that's why I'm talking to you guys. That's where we're hanging out. So that's why we're doing this right now. How are you? How are you good at building? I'm not building anything. Um, I screamed at the very beginning of the video. So. The very beginning of the video. <laughs> the good news is that no one was hurt. Um, hi, Daily Dose. Hello. Hello. Why is your voice deep? Um, some people think it's high-pitched and soft. Well, I guess medium-pitched. Um, but I don't know. I didn't have a decision in it. I was just kind of given this thing called puberty. So, yeah. The funny thing is that, you know, most people, when they get puberty, when they hit puberty and their voice drops, um, they recognize it, they, they realize the difference. I never realized that because I never talked. So if you never talk, you won't realize that your voice will change. Um, so I never experienced that since I never talked. Crazy to think about. Absolutely mind-blowing. So, like, I don't know. I, I never experienced that change that a lot of people had to go through. But, um, what's your opinion? Come on, you guys. You guys are just giving me lame questions. There's a difference between, like, deep questions and just lame questions. Very lame. Like, how do you want me to answer these? Very lame. Why are you such a nice guy, Daily Dose? Because, uh, oh, we got diamonds. <laughs> Woo! All right, so this has been an awesome, awesome excursion here. This has been fantastic. So we're going to find a few more. And I don't know why I thought it was a good idea to dig for diamonds, look for diamonds using diamonds. All right, so... Yes, so now we're up to nine. Excellent. Fantastic. Um, absolutely incredible. Um, so yeah, using the iron pickaxes pick was just a phenomenally brilliant idea by me. I know, I know. Um, did you have bullies in school? Yeah, uh, I don't know. I, I know I was, like, I was like sexually harassed at one point and I didn't even realize it. That's how inept I was. I didn't even realize I was sexually harassed by a, another classmate and I didn't even realize it. Um, he took his hand and slid it up my butt crack and said credit card and then I didn't realize that. I was like, oh, okay, that happened. Um, so, but it didn't have, I didn't realize until years later, I was like, oh, I was, um, I was sexually harassed. Um, I was literally sexually molested, and I didn't even realize that. Um, someone says, why do you think we exist? Dude, that's been, that's been bothering me for a while. Like, it's been really bothering me for a while, that question. Your videos always... Thank you, thank you. Sorry, I gotta read that question. Your videos have calmed my anxiety for years. Yeah, dude, that question has been bothering me for a very long time. 
Why do we exist? And so here's the thing. I made a tweet about this because I was very frustrated. I was like, okay, so let me get this straight. So we live for 70 plus years, and then we learn things, we explore, we do all sorts of fun things. And then we... Uh Uh-oh. Let me stop for a second. Is the... Is he at a stream lag? Hold up. I'll, I'll wait for a second. Just stream lag for a second. We're waiting. We're waiting. We're waiting. Um. Okay. We're just waiting for a second. We're waiting for things to get better. Um, is it, is it a little better now? Is the stream better? Is the stream better now, guys? Is it better? Is it better? Is it back? Okay, we're good. Just, we're good? We're good. So you're telling me we're good. Okay. Is, is it okay? We're all back. Okay, so let me get back to my point. So we're all, we're all good on stream health and everything, and it's, it's healthy. Okay. So we're expected to live for 70 plus years. Um, wait, where did this make the thing go? Okay. So we're expected to live for 70 plus years, experience things, go through life, all these fun things, learn things, and then we just disappear appear and die and that's it it's just i don't know i don't know if i'm okay with that like it seems really frustrating it's like i want to know the mysteries of life i want to know the mysteries of of everything and um the most frustrating thing is that our knowledge is basically capped because um we can only observe what is happening in our own universe. Um, So we can't observe what is outside of our own universe. And that by itself is very frustrating because that's something, I don't don't know if that's something we could ever figure out because in order to study something, you have to observe it. And if you can't physically observe it, uh, how are you supposed to figure things out? So that's just really frustrating. Um... Yeah, so yeah, that's been that's been bothering me. Uh, do I believe in God? Um, I'm agnostic. Um, now here's the thing. Here's the thing, though. Um, I actually kind of jumped around a little bit. I was I was raised very very religious. I was a very religious person. And then, I don't know, something happened and I just went totally atheist. I went totally atheist. And then, now I'm back to agnostic. So that's where I'm at right now. Um, is the, is it still lag? Atheist. I went totally atheist. Huh. Is it okay now? Is it okay? Okay, so we're good now? Okay, I I don't know what's going on with YouTube. I'm sorry about that. But, um, yeah, I mean, I used to be atheist because, like, oh... You know, that's what science says. And then I went, well, I don't know. Like, it's that aspect that you can't, you can't study something you can't see. And in, in that regard, like, well, how am I supposed to scientifically prove that nothing exists? Something out there doesn't exist. So if you, if you can prove that something does exist, how, how can you prove that something also does not exist? And that alone is what made me uh, think agnostically. Um, like, I don't know, it just didn't seem, it's a little weird. 
how do I get back to my... Um, am I going the right way? I'm so confused. Oh my gosh. I go this way. We're going back this way. We're going to go make another pickaxe. Um, oh, now that we're here, let's go get these. And then we'll make some more sticks. Do I have any sticks? Um, where'd it go? Beautiful. We'll take these, place those there. Someone says, daily dose of these nuts. All right. Love it. Love to see it. Um, let's go here. Let's go there. One, two, three. One, two, three. Go that. Sorry, that. And then that. And then we should be good. Okay. And then... What am I doing? I just threw my pickaxe away. I don't want to do that. I don't know. Someone says lag, 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 but according to YouTube, it says excellent connection. I don't know what to say about that. <laughs> Daily dose of cringe. All right. I guess. Okay, so let's get back to digging. Back to digging. Now that we have some good stuff here. We got some good stuff. So back back to the questions. Um, back to the questions. I'm just trying to read some right now. Trying to find some good ones. Oh, I, I do need to eat. Thank you for reminding me. Okay. Um, make a chest? Not right now. Not right now. Trying to... Do you... Come on, guys. What is... My real name is Jason. My real name is Jason. That is my real name. Have you showed your face in a video? Punch a door. Do you watch anime? Nope. 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 I'm obsessed with learning right now, so... Definitely, I'm obsessed with learning, so... I don't... No offense, but you don't really learn uh, much when you watch uh, TV shows or cartoons. That sort of thing. I, I'm talking about, like, scientific stuff. I don't know if that's controversial, but I think it's pretty well established that... Um, a anime is for entertainment and not educational purposes. I'm not trying to start a start a war here, but I'm. If anime was educational, like overly educational, not um, entertainment, I would definitely watch that. Um. Do you like Star Wars? Uh, I don't know. Never been a fan. What's your IQ, dude? I don't even know. No idea, man. Do you believe we are alone in the universe? It's possible. It's totally possible. Yeah. I mean, at this given, at this point in time, like, it's very possible um, that there were other beings that have existed well before us, and then they just died off. Who's to say that their civilization didn't just die off? Um... So you just never know. What is the scariest event you've ever witnessed? I didn't see that fast enough. Eli plays raid. You can raid people on YouTube? I thought that was only a Twitch thing. Wait, I thought you could only raid people on Twitch. You can raid people on, on YouTube? I'll have to figure that out, because that'd be kind of cool to do. Um, let me put this down. I am just trying to read some questions here. Will I play Among Us? Nope. 
<laughs> Try using a stone pickaxe to be more economic. Uh, dude, I got so many... I got so much iron that I can just burn through it, so... It's alright. Can you speak normally for, t for 10 seconds? What are you talking about? Am I not speaking normally? What does that even mean? What does that mean? This is me speaking normally. Um... Hi, I'm speaking normally right now for 10 seconds. Is that okay? Am I doing a good job? I don't know. I'm just speaking normally, and I'm being told that I'm not speaking normally, so. Oh, good question. Am I afraid of death? Um, I'm not afraid of it. So, like, let's say if I if I died right now, I would be very upset. Um, but, of course, I'd be dead, so I wouldn't be able to give an opinion. But, um, theoretically, I'd be very upset because I feel like there's so many things I want to do, so many things I want to accomplish, so many things I want to achieve. So, yeah, I'd be very frustrated. I'd be very upset. I'd be like, I cannot believe I just died. I cannot believe I just died. Like, that would be me. I'd be like, I, dude, I was, I'm, I'm furious, I'm frustrated. I'd, I had so many things I wanted to do, so many things I wanted to get done, and you just went and killed me. Thank you. That's so annoying, so frustrating. I had things to do, people to talk to, people to hang out with. I was supposed to do this, I was supposed to do that, and I died. Thanks so much. That is extremely frustrating. So, uh, no, I'm not afraid of it. I would just be extremely pissed off, and yeah. But I think, obviously, there's the... And, you know, there's the, the want of not dying. So. What is, what's your passion? Um, enjoying nature. Enjoying life. And uh, enjoying what it has to offer. Do you like eggs? Yeah, I like scrambled eggs. Nope, no girlfriend. Have you ever gone skydiving? No. That was one of the things I thought about. Um, especially when I was very depressed, I was like, if I ever got to a point where I was very, very depressed, I would try doing the craziest things. I would try skydiving. I would try very dangerous slash safe things, you know, um, just for fun. It's like just to live. Um, cause when you're depressed, you, you don't feel like you're living. So if you can do something dangerous but controlled, um, yeah, gosh, the feeling of feeling alive would probably be amazing, wouldn't it? So I would love to, I mean, I'm saying, if I ever got to that point where I was just so depressed, I would love to give that a shot. Um, I'm not saying that's a cure or anything, I'm just saying that's that's something that I would try and do just to make myself feel alive. Do you ever laugh? Yeah, I laugh all the time. You gotta watch my streams. You gotta watch my streams. Uh, do you listen to Bob Dylan? No. Do you think that an afterlife is possible? I think anything is possible. We just don't know. I don't know. Anything is possible, dude. One thing that I've learned about science is that any, literally anything is possible. And um, we just don't have the, uh, all the answers, and we never will. So it's just frustrating. Do you plan on streaming on Twitch? No, not at all. Never. Favorite Pop-Tart? Um, I don't eat Pop-Tarts because it's just sugar, and um, so it's not good for you, like, at all. I don't know why it's marketed as good for you when it's not good for you at all. Um, it's just sugar. That's all it is. Um, but when I did eat um, unhealthy things, I did like the Oreo Pop-Tarts. But of course, that's just because you're just, you're basically at that point, you're just eating pure Oreos. Um, so it's like, okay. Um, have you ever... You still working out? Oh yeah, for sure. I, I had a good workout today. I did triceps and biceps. Um, and it's just, it's crazy how long it takes to do biceps and triceps. I don't know why, but for me, it, it takes a while. 
and it takes a long time. I, I try to have my workouts only be an hour long every day, but for, for biceps and triceps, I usually have to go longer. Um, I don't know why, but I, I just, before I actually start getting tired. Have you ever thought about making a gaming channel? Bro. <laughs> Bro. Uh, you're on a gaming channel right now. Did I really just... Okay, I guess it's time to make another iron pickaxe. Another iron pickaxe. Are your videos easy or hard to make? Um, I don't know, nothing... I don't think anything on YouTube is easy to do. Um, I don't know. I don't know what to say. It's definitely not easy and it's definitely not hard, so... I don't know. I don't know how to answer that. We're going to take this and make some more sticks. So where's my stickies? One, two. One, two, and then we'll go... Nope. Um, and then we'll go here. Beautiful. And then we'll take this and swap out here. Love the stuff. Thanks for your videos. You're welcome. We are just trying to figure out this iron stuff. Uh, I don't know. So we gotta figure out the way back out of here. Is it this way? I just want to make sure it's this way. So we don't get lost. Oh boy. Where do I go? I just want to make sure we find the way out of here. Where? Okay, so it's right here. Beautiful. Beautiful. Uh, let's just randomly block it off and say you can't go past there. Okay. Let's try digging over here. See what happens. Hello, ultra famous human organic being. How's it going? That's what someone told me. I don't know. Do you like, f do you fish? Oh, did you guys watch that documentary on Netflix called Seaspiracy? Highly recommend it. Might change your mind about um, about eating fish. Very good, very good documentary. Um, like, like for example, I didn't know that plastic only kills a thousand sea turtles. Only it, so plastic pollution kills a thousand sea turtles in the in United States waters every year. The United States fishing industry kills 250,000 um, sea turtles every year. So the fishing industry actually kills 250 times more sea turtles than plastic does. That is mind-blowing. Absolutely mind-blowing. Uh, and I didn't know that. But yeah, so lots of good, lots of good um, topics like that. In that in that documentary, so highly recommend it. Um, but yeah, I, that's why I don't eat fish because I feel bad for the sea turtles. I feel bad for the fish. Um, but it doesn't matter. I mean, there's nothing that I can really do to do that. Uh, and then we're predicted to basically have um, empty seas and virtually empty. The fishing industry is predicted to collapse within the next 20 years here. Um, that is what they are predicting because we're just eating too many fish to the point where there won't be any fish left to eat at the demand that we have right now. So, yeah. So it doesn't matter what I do. The point is it's either people start eating less fish or there just simply won't be enough fish left. So it's like, uh, I don't know what to say. It's like you either comply or you're forced to comply regardless. Excuse me, why fish? Oh, I already, I already, that's what, yeah, okay. Um, cause, okay, I'm just gonna ignore that question. You have diamonds? Yeah, I got diamonds. I got nine of them. Can we just burn plastic? Mm, I, I guess that's a lot of pollution. Um, but yeah. 
So is eating fish a bad thing? Um, I'm not telling you what to do. You can do whatever you want. But I specifically don't eat fish because I don't want to hurt um, sea turtles. I don't want to hurt the environment. I don't want to um, and, uh, hurt. I don't want to support the fishing industry. The fishing industry is very scummy. It's very scummy the way they do things. Um, I don't know. I just highly recommend that documentary. And like I said, I, 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 I ate fish. I basically, I had no problem eating fish until I watched that documentary. I, I, I loved fish. I loved eating fish until I saw Sea Spiracy, and then I was like, oh, I did not know I was contributing to killing 250,000 sea turtles every year. Didn't know that. Because, so basically what they do is they have these giant nets, they scrape the bottom of the ocean, and then they bring it up, and then they scoop up sea turtles in the, in the process, they drown, um, etc, etc, etc. They, they die while they're in the nets. So, and um, they, they know this. They actually put it in their formula. These fishermen, they call it um, bycatch, I think is what it's called. So they're aware that they will. The, the fishermen, when they cast their nets, they're aware that they will catch sea turtles regardless. They know that they're going. So like, it's basically a, a well-thought-out way of... It's like, okay, here, we're going to kill some sea turtles in the process. But how many fish are we going to catch in the process? And that's what, uh, that's what matters. So, yeah. That's why I don't eat fish. But you guys can do whatever you want. Um, what's, what's the way out of here? Is it this way? Okay, it's out here. We're gonna go drop off our diamonds. Uh, am I vegan? Yeah, I'm vegan. I am. But I don't care what you guys do. I'm, I'm, I do it, uh, cause I just, I love the animals too much. Um, I can get really, I can get really in depth about that if you guys want me to, but probably, my guess is you guys don't want me to. Yeah, I mean, I used to eat uh, meat all the time. I, I loved it. I, I think meat tastes amazing. But uh, ultimately, I I don't know. I just, I eventually felt too bad for the animals. And uh, yeah, so I changed my, my eating habits. <clears throat> but what I eat doesn't represent who I am at all. So it's just something that I do. Um, let's see here. Okay, so we're going to drop these off. So now we have 11 total diamonds. That's not nearly enough. We need a lot more. Um, cool. Someone says... Have you showed... Uh, I'm just trying to see if there's any other questions here. Someone says, why three diamond leggings? Yeah, that was a mistake we did. Uh, I accidentally made too many. I had like 40 diamonds, accidentally spent them all on diamond leggings. So that was a mistake. Um, yeah, I don't know. I think this is a good place to end the stream. Thanks for joining today, guys. Um, excellent, fun stream. I had a lot of fun. And I know you guys, I know you guys did too. Um, so yeah, that's the end of the stream. I really hope you enjoyed and I'll see you guys again very, very soon. Later.